What is going on guys, it's Tommy with Gaming HD here and welcome to this second Inform Kostic play review. The 84 rated Serbian who plays for Hamburg in the Bundesliga. Now this card is a position change from his left midfield card to a centre forward card. Now he has 4 star skill moves, 2 star weak foot and he cost me 85,000 coins on the PlayStation market. Now the like target for this video is 15 likes so if you could smash that like button right now it would be very much appreciated. Also guys if you could stick around towards the end of the video as I need your help sorting out the ratings on these cards and I need a bit of feedback. On screen is in game stats, if you wish to look at them in more detail pause the video right now but we'll move on to his base card stats. He has 91 pace, 81 shot, 83 passing, 86 dribbling, 43 defending and 80 physical stats. So 5 out of the 6 stats there are over 80 which is incredible. This is the side that we played him in. As you can see, the back seven is really what we use for the weekend league. Pogba, we've got Costa, we've got Matthias, Ake, Rose. And up front, we put Werner and we have the footmas card. And I cannot, for the love of me, remember what it is. But we'll move on to the five in-game stats that start out for me. So it has 86 attacking positioning, 86 free kick accuracy, 91 curve, 91 shot power, and 92 crossing. So we have some very impressive stats there. Now the positives of this card. Having 91 pace is fairly rapid. Really do like that in a striker who is physical and is strong as well. And it works really well for him. His uh, passing it seems to be very, very much spot on. His long passing isn't great, but his short passing in between the, the front three works really well. Um, that's what I really do like about this formation. If you've got a player who can pass the ball well, and can finish it seems to be the perfect combination his strength and his hold up play was absolutely incredible he had Werner at the side of him who he'd hold up the ball for wait for Werner to make a, a run pass it through and then Werner would sort of like make a run so Kosic could get back in and score a goal it worked an absolute treat um, his shooting obviously inside the box and even outside the box is very very good indeed now you'll see him making some good runs and I do like that about this card. He seemed to do that very well. As you can see, he does sort of score some very, very good goals as well. Like outside the box curve, his 91 curve, it just works very, very well for him. Negatives about this card. Obviously, there are a couple of negatives. The first one, obviously, is it's not something that he can change, but it's his nationality. Obviously, being Serbian in the Bundesliga, you're going to have to link him up with Hamburg players or Bundesliga players because you're not going to get much of into a hybrid. And his weak foot seemed very, very inconsistent for me. Sometimes it felt three or four star, and then sometimes it felt one or two. Uh, his price, eight out of 10. Positioning, eight out of 10. Hybrid ability, seven. Weekend league ability, seven. Performance, nine. Enjoyability, nine. Eight overall. He doesn't make the foot leaderboard. However, all this stuff is about to change. Now, I want your advice. I want you to tell me what you would like to see in the play review breakdown. Do you still want price? Do you still want positioning? Do you still want all those stats there? Or do you want something completely different? If you have some suggestions, leave them down below. And I think we're going to change the leaderboard up. I think we're going to have a separate leaderboard just for informs, starting from next week. And then one for icons, and we'll have one for just normal players. And maybe informs will just include special cards as well, apart from icons. But let me know. Comment down below what you think is important. Do we need different tiers for prices? For example, 10 to 70k for informs or 70 to 200k and then 200k plus? It's up to you. I just need your advice. Anyway, 15 likes is the target. Drop a like. Goodbye.